guys another episode here of this truck can be yours so we affectionately call this truck old blue and this is kind of like a brother or a sister to big red you guys remember big red so this is another one of those 155 inch wheelbase so 84 inch cab to axle one ton four wheel drive that means it's got 11 foot flatbed instead of like an eight or nine foot uh this has got a big block 392 it's got a four speed Power steering, power brakes, Dana 70 in the front, RA15 in the rear. This is your true blue, hardworking American truck. Like, there is not a job this truck can't do. Uh, two things this truck has, needs that we are going to do before it leaves. Uh, it needs a windshield, which we're going to have the glass guy do. And the exhaust was junk on it, so we cut it off. So right now it's just straight pipe out of the manifold. So, you know, it sounds like a drag, drag car, which is cool but not a daily type thing a um, couple things we did do to this truck it is a very solid original truck underneath this primer is the original blue paint and Lucy's gonna check it out the floors on this truck we'll zoom in here so you can see we actually patched the floors it had the normal little rust spots on the floors it has all new floors we welded all those in, painted, and then it's got spray and bed liner so it will last the test of time. Threw the seat back in and everything else. It's runner driver. Um, again, on the tires, like we always say, 16 inch wheels and tires. The tires that are on it hold air and it will drive around the property and it'll drive on the transport no problem. If you want to drive it down the road every day other than on your ranch, you're going to want to put tires on it. And I've said it all the time. I will keep telling you guys so you know. We don't usually put the tires on these because everybody has their own picky idea of what they want on tires. And we've put a lot of sets of tires on in the past and people have asked us to take them off because they want to put something else on. So I kind of don't do as much tires anymore. If the tires are good and they will go in the transport truck, then they're, you get whatever you want to get when you get the truck. So um, really solid old truck. I'm just going to leave Lucy in there because apparently that's where she wants to be. You can see the flatbed, it's 11 foot, it's steel on top of wood, so there actually is a wood deck underneath the steel. All the lights work, all the gauges work, cab lights, everything else, got the west coast mirrors on it. Does not have a gooseneck hitch, but it does have the regular receiver hitch. This would be an awesome truck for one of you guys who's a landscaper or a contractor or a... Uh, you know somebody goes out and bids a lot of jobs and stuff and you want to like have your business card be your truck have something that's super cool and old and vintage and awesome looking you can put your logos on the doors drive it around town go do all your bids and go see customers deliver furniture in it you know whatever whatever your job might be but it'd be a heck of a good advertising piece so think about that when you're looking at some of these um i think it still has the original couple of logos it was uh the Wagon Wheel Sales Company, which was in Idaho. The other door, actually, we'll walk around the other side. You can see a little bit better. I think it was a farm and ranch supply store. So, kind of cool. I love it when that stuff's still on there. Yeah, Wagon Wheel Sales Company. Right there, Blackfoot, Idaho. So, that's kind of neat. And then down here... You can see the old GVW, it said 12,000 GVW. I kind of just sanded right here so you guys can see the primer does come off. That, that blue paint is the original paint. So if you think this would be a good work truck or an advertising truck or farm truck for you, or maybe you want big red and old blue, you want to get a package, get two of them, that's fine. Uh, she's ready to go other than exhaust in the window, which we will do before it leaves. Give us a call, uh, shoot us a DM on Instagram, or email us, 406garagesales at gmail.com. Thank you for watching, liking, subscribing, and we'll see you on the next one.